Should we rate this? Yeah, dude. Let's go for it. All right. We got the larceny. I pause like there's a commercial break. <laughs> we'll be right back after these messages. <laughs> All right. So we got the larceny, uh, Kentucky straight bourbon whiskey. This is a high, like a weeded bourbon. So what we mean by weeded, and if you tuned into the Hartman's bourbon talk, we talked about this. So this is something that next month, if we're still doing it on Zoom, definitely attend because there's a ton of information in there that you can use it's an amazing amazing content but the mash bill for this specific bourbon is 68 percent corn which is required for bourbon more than 51 percent 20 percent wheat so it's a very high weeded bourbon and then 12 percent mal- malted barley so label brandy mike what are you giving it a plus plus a plus plus same i like that again just because of the name that it's fully embracing the whole start of this whole distillery where he would just go in with the keys and steal some larceny and then the logo is a key and a keyhole it's just very consistent i like that stuff it gives me closure it doesn't make my brain hurt um like i remember brian regan skit a while ago where he's like i knew a guy who was a roofer and his last name was fiedler and then he named the roofing company Fiedler's Roofing Company. It's like, dude, you couldn't name yourself Fiedler on the roof, you know? But, like, he was so stupid and didn't make it Fiedler's Roofing Company. It would have been the same if this person didn't name it something larceny, you know? Like, you had such a colorful story to get to this point, and you're going to completely abandon it? Like, that's not cool. So, I like that. That gives me closure. All right, nose. What are you getting for nose? A little toffee, a little vanilla. Very, 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 very hint of caramel. Maybe that's the toffee, though, too. I'm also getting a little butterscotch. Okay, I can see that. I like that. Mm, this is good. This is good. It's good. Yeah. Okay. A plus plus. A plus plus. Initial taste. Um, getting like a bread. Fresh yeah, bread. Yeah, like honestly, if you were to put wheat bread in the toaster oven and put butter on it, that's literally what they taste like. Hundred percent. So bread butter. Wheat bread butter. Yeah. Yeah. Rating. This is so delicious. Uh, a plus. A plus. A plus. No, you know what? A check mark. Throw you a little curveball. I'm okay with that. A check mark. I agree, I agree, I agree. I agree, I agree, I agree. Ending notes. Did I tell you that I said that at work? <laughs> no. Let's get through this rating first. Stick around if you want to hear it. Or Dude. tune in Monday if you want to hear it. So bad. I forgot where I was. <laughs> Basically, in short, somebody asked my opinion, I said my opinion, and then they said, oh, I agree, and then I just verbatim started spitting out, I agree, I agree, I agree, I agree, and they literally looked at me like I was insane, and I'm like, never mind, all's fine, <laughs> just walked away. Oh my god. Alright, ending notes, what do you get on the ending note? Guys. <laughs> <laughs> Wedding note. Or wending note. Wedding? Ending note. I'm getting... And we talked about this during the bourbon talk. I'm getting like a, a wet grass on the ending note. That's what I can feel going down. Wet grass, and I'm also getting caramel. Wet caramel grass. Yes. Rating? It's an A for sure. There's no yeah. doubt. Yeah. A plus plus check mark. Sure. So, right. white grass and then caramel. And, like, whiskey tastes are so weird. Like, the notes that you're picking up, it might not sound appetizing to you. Like, white grass doesn't seem very appetizing to anybody. But, but when you taste delicious. it, yeah. You're, you're going to be reminded of the white grass, but it still goes down so 
delicious. <sighs> Whiskey is very, very interesting. I'm obsessed with it. Yeah. Clearly. Ooh, this is very good. Rating. Drop that countdown. Three, two, one.